Hey everybody. I hope you're having a great day. Mine started off okay and then it kind of went to hell in a handbasket. Um, it's been a little bit rough the last couple of hours. but uh, And I can't lie, Oreos had some help in that. I'm much better. <laughs> but, as you can see, we have the makeup basket. And we'll do... I'm taking out my glasses. They glare. But, um, and anyway... But um, we have makeup basket today. Um, it's not, I don't really do, it. I don't really call it weekly or monthly. I just kind of, this is my makeup basket for at least the month of June. Some of this stuff is going to stay until it's gone, and we'll kind of go over that as we go, because I have a lot of project pan in here, and I'm trying to have it as organized as possible. And yes, see, there's my little makeup basket with my little Christmassy stuff. And so... Not all this is going to be cruelty free. Some things are not cruelty free because I got to use them up. So it's just one of them things. Um, if it's not in Project Pan, it gets rotated just like everything else. But we'll go ahead and get started because I have a whole lot and we do not want this to have two parts. <laughs> and I apologize, my hair looks all ratchet and crazy. It's up in one of those clippy banana, you know, those little clippy things. Can you see? Um, I went to the food pantry today to volunteer and um, some of my makeup is still intact. <laughs> anyway, well, let's go ahead and get started. So first, for primers, I have several because some of them are probably going to run out before the end of the month. Um, so I have a few. So we're going to go ahead um, and starting off with um, the Bare Minerals Prime Time Foundation Primer. You've seen that before. I have a little sample of the Too Faced Primed and Poreless SPF 20 Bronze Tint. I'm going to be hopefully trying that out. Um, the Tarte Clean Slate Flawless 12 Hour Brightening Primer. You know I love this and it should be gone in the next week or so. But anyway. Um, and then I have a sample of the Tarte BB Primer in medium. I thought it was light. It is medium. For eye primers, I have the Brightening Pearl Primetime from Bare Minerals, which is part of my project theme. And still going strong. I use it pretty much every day. Um, when that runs out, I'm going to move on to the Tarte 360. 360 degree creaseless 12 hour smoothing eye primer. This is a little deluxe sample, so I'll be moving on to that. When that is finished, then I'll probably go pull an elf out, but here nor there, randomness. Um, I will use when I finish the tart, then I will move on to the prime time brightening primer from Bare Minerals, and this is also in my project pan. For tinted moisturizer stuff, um, this is the e.l.f. Tinted Moisturizer SPF 20 in the color Porcelain. I mix this with moisturizer to make it work. Um, the When this runs out, I actually want to try the Physician's Formula Organic Wear. Um, next thing is um, a friend of mine sent this to me. This is the Flower BB Cream. That's from the Drew Barrymore Flower Beauty, and that is in BB2. Um, I'll be testing that out um, sometime in the next month or so. I may alternate, um, you know, maybe, you know, use this on one day and use that on another. I'm not sure exactly. But when I try it, I'm going to try it for about a week to see if it breaks me out. Anyway, then for um, foundation... Um, this is part of my project pan. This is Laura Geller Balance and Brighten in Regular. For setting powders, I have the uh, Bare Minerals Hydrating Mineral Veil, which is in my project pan, and the Tarte Smooth Operator Amazonian Clay Finishing Powder, just in case I want something different. Um, for mascara, um, I have the Elf Mineral Infused Mascara, which is almost empty, and so when that is gone, then I'll move on to finishing up my Tarte Lights Camera Lashes. For Tinted Lip Balm, I'm using up, and I nicked it today, the 
Jack of all trades from Bare Minerals in Lean on Me. I am wearing that right now. It is a nude. For lip liner, this is also in my project pan. Um, I don't think this is in my project pan. Did I just say it was? It's not. I'm sorry. Um, I have the Thistle from Bare Minerals, which is basically my lip color. It looks a little dark on here, but it's not. I wear this every time that I wear lip liner, so this is my only lip liner that I'm using right now. Um, for facial stuff, I have the Bare Minerals Well Rested, and I use that with a flat, uh, large fa uh, face brush to pat on like my cheeks when they get extra red in my chin, and the yellow diffuses that very well. And then for facial concealer, I'll be using the Summer Bisque from Bare Minerals. And then, let's see what we've got here. Under eye concealer. You've seen this a lot. Palladio Herbal Stick Concealer in light. And I always set it with the ELF HD Under Eye Setting Powder. Then, for, I'm just kind of start grabbing. So I'm going to be using my Tarte Carried Away palette. Um, specifically, I'm kind of leaning towards these, uh, this more warm quad here and maybe this green one down here. Um, this is the Wet n Wild Eye Sparkle in Star Clusters. I use all of it together except for the blue and I use the blue completely separately. But I'm focusing more on the, the neutral colors. Um, this is in my project pan. This is the Laroque Movie Star Trio, the Starry Eyed Baked Eyeshadow Trio. And if you can see, see right there, I have hit some pan, baby. This all here is pan. It just is the same color, and then the white is the inner part of it. And so I've got that. Um, I'm using my L'Oreal Infallible for this month. is going to be Liquid Diamond, which is just the silvery pinky gray one. Um, I'm going to be using, I'm getting Sunburned from Wet n Wild. Then I've got from Bare Minerals, I have the Phenomenon, which I use the gold. I don't use the other one when I finish it. My friend Debbie gets it. And then in the crease, I use this. This is from the, Mor the Vision, and I use the darker color, which is Mirage, which kind of reminds you of Max. I don't remember. I don't remember. It's that uh, brown with the minty is in the blues and everything. What is that? Is that Club? Is that right? I don't remember. I'm not a Mac person. Um, and then I've got Hard Candy in High Maintenance. Or I'm sorry, this is in Peace. For my facial highlighter, this is Secret Radiance from Bare Minerals. My eyeliner has it has always been, and it's almost gone. This is Urban Decay Corrupt and Zero, with which I use for Corrupt. I use the Milani Baked in Fusion. As bases, I have the Bad to the Bronze color tattoo. I have Mutt from Bare Minerals, which is also kind of a bronzy. It's a little more warm. I have the It Cosmetics Pretty and Smoke Trio. And... I have, this is my new, my warmer palette, um, this one here is Mocha, and this one here is Driftwood, those are the two I'm really focusing on. Now I'm about to run out of time, so I am going to be forced to do a part two to continue on with the rest, and I apologize. Normally my makeup baskets are not this large, but I have a lot of stuff that's about to be used up. So I apologize. So you'll see this one, and then you'll see another. Bye!